What a beautiful day it is here in Ward 6. I, I live here, so I didn't have to travel that far. We're here to explore the wharf and its brand new development and spend the day with Councilmember Charles Allen and see how he is when he's off the dais. Good morning. <laughs> how are you today? Doing great. How are you today? I mean, I feel good because we're in my ward. That's I live right. Here. You are Ward Six on the water, right here in southwest of the wharf. Yes, our ward. That's right. Well, it's beautiful. Can we take a look around? Can you Absolutely. show me around? Absolutely. I would love to. Let's take a look. Let's do it. This is so cute. It comes alive at night, and a yeah. lot of folks come out, um, especially on a cool night. Mm -hmm. The fire is going, and uh, it just becomes a great place where neighbors meet and um, spend a little time out on the waterfront. So, growing up, is this the life you pictured? Not at all, no. <laughs> um, my background is actually in healthcare, mm -hmm. and so I started off wanting to work in healthcare policy. And the more that I got involved, though, with health policy, I realized that it did matter a lot who it was that was in elected positions to help make decisions for our city and to make those types of decisions. So I kind of made that transition from doing policy work into starting to engage on the politics. And at first I was helping getting other people elected to office and then when the opportunity yeah. presented itself, I then decided to run myself. Help and yourself, yeah. <laughs> luckily the good people of Ward 6 decided to give me a shot. Can we do five favorites real quick? I'm gonna ask you. I will do my best. Five favorite things. Favorite food. Oh, uh, I like pasta. Okay. Very fan. Favorite cartoon growing up? Oh my gosh, favorite cartoon growing up. I enjoy He-Man. Okay. Yeah. Favorite season? I enjoy the fall. Uh, <laughs> I really enjoy the, the crisp air. Favorite movie? Mmm. I'm kind of an Avengers fan right now, so the whole series. Wow. Who's your favorite Avenger? Well, I kind of enjoy Iron Man. Oh, okay. Yeah. And favorite restaurant in DC? I can't pick just one. What? Every restaurant in Ward 6 is my favorite. Oh, come on. <laughs> Fine. I watch Game of Thrones. Okay. Westworld. And outside of that, I, I couldn't tell you what TV shows I, I watch. My wife and I dedicate a couple of, of hours of, of our kind of favorite shows, but mm -hmm. that's about it. Wow. So if you get the chance to do a cameo on Game of Thrones, are you down? I would completely do that. Absolutely. <laughs> Tell me your cute love story. How did you guys meet? How did you know she was the one? Oh, it's such a DC story. Um, I wrote a bill. And so <laughs> she uh, she used to work at the council, actually, mm -hmm. um, what, long before I ever joined the council. And I was doing healthcare policy work. I wrote legislation, because uh, I thought it'd be a really great way to, to meet her. And um, brought it to her, and we worked on the <laughs> bill, and then I finally convinced her we should go out and uh, have dinner. You wrote legislation just to get a date? Absolutely. Oh, it's so worth it, right? <laughs> <laughs> totally worth it. That is so cute. Congratulations. Oh, there's swings. There are swings. <laughs> These are very popular, especially on the weekends. You know what? This is like a good space to like take Instagram pictures. So what's another spot in Ward 6 that's one of your favorites? Well, you know, Ward 6 spreads from Shaw to Southwest, from RFK and Hill East, all the way through Capitol Hill. But why don't we head over to Eastern Market? It's just an iconic, okay. beautiful space. Uh, it's packed out on the weekends, but um, let's go check that out. Okay. Talk about a transition from the newness of the wharf to a building with such history. Yeah, welcome to Eastern Market. This was uh, built in 1873. It's been for over 100 years serving the city and the residents of Ward 6 and Capitol Hill. 100 years? Well, let's hope it stays put while we're in there. It's a great space, great markets, and on the weekends, this place is really alive with artists and merchants and fresh food and farmers. It's a great space to, to find your friends and neighbors every weekend. I want to meet some friends and neighbors. Let's do it. All right, let's go in. So how has Eastern Market changed over the years? Well, Eastern Market's been here for over 100 years, and you had a lot of family-owned businesses that have been here for a long time. About nine years ago, we actually suffered a pretty much catastrophic fire that almost burned the entire place down. Uh, the structure was saved, and the city spent millions of dollars to rebuild it and then move a lot of our businesses right back in. Do you do some shopping here? I do. I love getting uh, my sausage, my bacon. I get fresh cheese here. This is really just a great space. So, council member, do you cook? I do cook a little bit, but my wife is much better than I am. Okay. What's your favorite dish she prepares? My wife is able to look in the refrigerator and the cabinets and she can find the ingredients for any meal whatsoever. It's amazing. <laughs> um, I am limited basically to grilling 
and cooking breakfast. I can okay. make really good waffles and really good pancakes, and I can do bacon. Nice, what do your kids like to eat? Waffles, pancakes, and bacon. <laughs> so they're not at that stage where they're like, no vegetables, I hate <laughs> it yet. They're pretty good eaters. Uh, okay. They're a typical five-year-old from time to time. They're pretty good at eating their vegetables. Awesome, well let's keep exploring. All right, let's do that. So welcome to Hill's Kitchen. Oh, yeah, it looks nice. Leah is one of our amazing owners of a small business as well as a resident um, okay. here on Capitol Hill in Ward 6. Also a huge Nationals fan. Huge. Huge. And what do you do to encourage residents to buy locally? We really make a big push that you can find pretty much everything you're looking for right here with our local businesses. And what that also means is you're keeping your dollar local, you're investing in your neighborhood businesses, those dollars get recycled back out in the community. So shop local, shop DC, and your dollar goes very, very far. So this has been such a great day. Well, thanks for joining me, absolutely. In a few years from now, what do you want your legacy to be in Ward 6? You know, I've, I've always thought about this as trying to make sure that Ward 6 is a place where everyone can always call it home. And that's everything from making sure that families see a future for their kids through our schools. It's where we have a place where housing works for everybody at all stages of your life. It's a place where, as we age, we can stay in our community and stay here. And it's a place where we have great amenities, like um, our, our libraries and our schools and our public parks and our playgrounds have really been invested. And so that's, those are the things I'm working toward. And I hope that, um, you know, when my term of service is over and I, I hand the torch on, um, that those are some of the things that we've accomplished and that we've left just a better neighborhood uh, than we started with. Well, you just encouraged me to re-sign my lease here there at Ward 6. But today didn't happen unless we take a selfie. All right, let's do no it. Mind? All right. As I like to say, it didn't happen if it's not on Twitter. <laughs>